and to start things off tonight, we have some girls basketball highlights. Centennial hosting Blaine. A lot riding on this game for Centennial. It was their senior night, as you can see Jill Conrad there with her parents. And Centennial, the number one team in the conference, had two losses prior to this one. So they were hungry for a win. And the Cougars caught fire right away with Deja Morris hitting a corner three to get things going. Blaine, struggling with possession on offense, turns it over, girding with the steal, finds Deja Morris for the layup, and she finishes. Deja would end up with 25 points that night. Again, the Cougars just dominating. Vertoy behind the arc, sinks the three-pointer, and on the very next possession, Vertoy again for three. What a beautiful shot, but guess what? She's not done yet. Can't stop Vertoy. <laughs> Vertoy sinks another three-pointer for the Cougars. She would go on to have 23 points. Boom, boom, Vertoy. And Jill Conrad would prove post players can hit the outside shots too by sinking the three ball for the Cougars. At half, Cougars would lead 55 to 11, but early in the second, Bengals would get a nice drive, but by Schwenglinger, she finishes and goes on to make the three, the free throw. The Cougars not backing down, though. Bertoy makes a nice cut to the basket with the finish and foul as well. Centennial causing havoc, gets the steal. This time, Deja finds Katie Worth down low for the two-pointer. And that star means that is a Play of the Week nominee. So we'll take another look at that one. Star wipe equals good. <laughs> Great playmaking there for the Cougars. And Centennial would end up winning 90 to 38. And we caught up with a couple Cougars Came after out the game. With a lot more intensity, and we focused and we played hard to get the win. Yeah. And Jasmine, you hit a number of open shots. Deja, you did as well, especially early on. Um, was there anything specifically that you thought your team was doing well to get you open shots tonight? Yeah, I really think we moved the ball around well, so then the defense had to collapse and it created open shots for everyone. 